welcome to the show. You are in conversation with Simply Sid. And today's guest is Mr. Donald Trump. Hi Donald, how are you? So Donald, I am quite intrigued. What made you come to this show? I want to speak to you tonight about the troubling events of the past week. Great. That's a, that's a good start, I would say. So, uh, does it have something to do with my tweet? I actually did not want to raise any alarm, but uh, now that you are here, uh, yes, we, we do have a huge following of Simply Said in India, and uh, it's it's roughly around two to three subscribers that I have. <laughs> so, were you actually scared when I said that America will know? There has been reporting that additional demonstrations are being planned in the coming days, both here in Washington and across the country. But who told you about all those things? Um, the agitations or the plannings that I was doing? Uh, how, how did you come to know about it? I have been briefed by the U.S. Secret Service on the potential threats. So, Donald, just in one short sentence, how did you feel when Biden said he will not give us raw material for vaccine? Like all of you, I was shocked and deeply saddened. What do you think the sentiments are of the American public today? It angered and appalled millions of Americans. How do you feel about it? I want to be very clear. I unequivocally condemn we cannot tolerate it. Now, I'm not expecting an apology from you because you are not the one who has stopped the vaccines or the raw materials for the vaccines. But still, uh, you were in power for such a long time. Any messages for Biden you want to give? Because I'm sure, as you are aware, he must be threatened as well from simply said followers. <laughs> two to three subscribers, I guess. These are tense and difficult times. What is needed now is for us to listen to one another not to silence one another. All of us can choose by our actions to rise above the rancor and find common ground and shared purpose. We must focus on advancing the interest, delivering the miracle vaccines, defeating the pandemic, rebuilding the economy, and upholding the rule of law. I also want to say a few words about the unprecedented assault on free speech. No, Donald, let's not talk about free speech. Uh, free speech is not really available on Simply Said. Uh, we're talking about one very important agenda. So let's stick to it. What would you say to American public? I know you're not in power, you can't do anything about it. But still, I, I hope Mr. Modi has helped you garner sufficient vote from Americans and Indian Americans. So, what is it that you would want to tell to American public? Whether you are on the right or on the left, a Democrat or a Republican, there is never a justification, no excuses, no exceptions. America is a nation of laws. Today, I am calling on all Americans to overcome the passions of the moment and join together as one. I saw you walk down the stairs of Air Force One, and it was a very windy day. And when you know that you have a wig on your head, <laughs> how would you describe that risky act that you did on the staircase the other day? Are wrong or dangerous? I know how you feel about China, but recently there was a video going rounds in YouTube and TikTok and whatnot. Chinese people were eating another insect oh. dipped in some kind of an acid. What do you think about it? We cannot tolerate it. I'm sure you're following Indian scenario in all these COVID times. And you've heard about Kumbh Mela that we've celebrated recently. I don't know why. But any views on that? What are your thoughts on it? Are dangerous. Are wrong. We cannot tolerate it. <laughs> So how was your last year? Pandemic, Corona, elections, what all things happened? Tragically, over the course of the past year, made so difficult because of COVID-19, we have seen political violence spiral out of control. 
We have seen too many riots, too many mobs, too many acts of intimidation and destruction. It must stop. India and America have had a good relationship. Do you think we will be able to work together and get out of this scenario which has been created by Biden? Any messages for India? Let us choose to move forward united for the good of our families, our communities. Is there anything you would want to say to Simply Said followers <laughs> in America? Now I am asking everyone who has ever believed in our agenda to be thinking of ways to ease tensions, calm tempers, and help to promote peace. I want to thank the hundreds of millions of who have responded to this moment with calm, moderation, and grace. We will get through this challenge just like we always do. Thank you, Donald. Thank you for being here. And I hope we'll have more such sessions. And if possible, next time get Biden also. He should not go Scott. Thank you. God bless you. So guys, this was episode. कुछ टफ सवाल पूछे हैं मैंने डोनल्ड से तो आई होप अगले एक या दो दिन में वैक्सीन रॉ मटेरियल शुड रीच इंडिया सो गाइस दैट वाज डोनल्ड ट्रंप फॉर यू नेक्स्ट टाइम दे वुड बी अनदर सेलिब्रिटी टिल देन चीयर्स बाय